Hello everybody and welcome to a Kapow Toys Review and I'm your host Ben off of Ben's Collectibles. We're looking at the Robots in Disguise Sergeant Cup from the Transformers Prime series. And here he is. Here's a quick look at the bio. Feel free to pause. He is only suitable for people the ages of five and up. Here he is out of the box. He does roll. Not brilliantly, but he does roll. Now I really like the look of this figure. Um, I know a lot of people are out there saying, yeah, yeah, but it's just Ironhide, it's just Ironhide. Yeah, but it's not. He's green, and he's got some detailing, and he's just got a cup feel about him. I really like him. See, I love the Generations Cup, and I really like this guy. Okay, yes, he has a hole in his butt, but hey, what are you going to do? A little bit of robot visible underneath, but let's put these... Uh, Mahusive cannons that come with him. Let's have a look, closer look. See if we can focus. There we go. See, these are fairly detailed. And if I just grab the second one. To get these to attach, there's uh, a couple of holes on the back. Basically, you plug the cannons in. If I can do this on camera. It's got to plug it in. And then uh, once they are in, you can wiggle it up slightly so it's uh, tilted. That's how they show it on the box. So it's kind of like a grenade launcher. Now, to get this guy transformed, I'm going to have to take the rockets off. And what we do, we pull the cab section, pull it forward. If I just, un there we go, it's unlatched. And then we grab the middle of the bonnet. And uh, once we grab it, we fold that back like so. Just need to uh, grab these arms. Just They just come unpinned. Turn it up, and with the uh, fist, just turn it back in on itself. If I do that with the other side, there we go, just turn it and back in on itself. Uh, just pull these apart slightly. There we go. I mean I'll get back to those in a minute anyway. So To get the head up we just push up this middle section. Right, twist these legs uh, now, just pull them down. See, if we pull them backwards on themselves, there's a hinge here that you just need to pull forward, and that unleashes his crotch. Turn his legs, fold the feet out, and twist them round. Let's do it again with this side. Just turn and twist. Right, with this top section, make sure these shoulder pads are pulled right out. You can then turn his wheels back on himself. Sorry, I'm trying to do this and talk on the camera. Uh, I'm not great at multitasking. Turn this fist round, and there we go. Now this top section, to get it in, you have to pull it backwards, push it forward on itself, and just poke it underneath where his shoulder pads are, and it should push down and drop into place. There we go. There. The back section just pulls down and pegs into the hole. Now, unfortunately, this is how Hasbro wants you to leave it, like this, with the big bit of kibble sticking out the back. But, what you can do, um, the fans version of this, you pull the back off and place it on round the other way. Pop the guns in the hands and there we have Cup. Now I think he looks absolutely awesome. I really do feel that he is a wrecker. I get that feel from him. Okay, he's not red, but you know, <laughs> I think there's going to be enough of a difference between this figure and Ironhide. Place the uh, two guns together forming a big, large rifle. I think that's a nice little touch. The only thing I feel lets this figure down to distinguish him from Ironhide is his face. If they had come up with a slightly different head sculpt, I honestly think that could have improved his figure vastly. I mean, there's limited articulation on this head as well. Compared to the other uh, Primes, he's about the same size as Ratchet, 
Um, slightly taller than Bumblebee, but fits in brilliantly with them. Let's, um, if I compare them to the uh, Generations Cup, slightly shorter, but again, I feel this figure could probably fit in with the Generations display. Now, he is available for order now. Just click on the link below, and make sure you check out my channel. That's also down there. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and take care.